All right, welcome to the Filthy Kitchen. I am the Squadgeman, and this is Filthy Kitchen Cooking with the Squadgeman. Just about to cook a few eggs with cheese. I got the eggs right here, got the butter in the pan. Mixing them up, yeah. Stir, stir, stir. Mix these eggs up. I haven't been to bed yet, and it is 10 o'clock in the morning. I have to work tonight. I did not work last night. I was too tired, but still, I could not sleep. So before I go to bed, I'm gonna have some eggs. And hopefully I'll be able to sleep with something in my stomach. That is the hope. Because I need some rest. I do need some rest, no doubt about it. And the best way to rest is to have something in my stomach. Now, generally, you should never go to bed with a full stomach like this because that's how you gain weight. That's what the sumo wrestlers do. Sumo wrestlers would always eat a big meal Drink lots of beer, go to sleep, take a nap. But I haven't eaten a whole lot. And where this is mainly protein, yes, there's fat. Hopefully it won't be converted into uh, too much fat. Oh boy, and the cheese, yeah, the cheese, got to put some cheese on there, so I got four eggs mixed with pepper, I'll take about as much cheese as I would have on a cheeseburger, and put that around pretty evenly on the eggs as they cook. Salt? No. There's enough salt. There's enough salt in the cheese. So it's just going to be eggs and pepper. And here's the plate. This is a plate once belonged to the father of my friend, who sadly passed away, but I get to think about him and my friend every time I use the plates, so it's a happy memory. It's a happy memory, sad times, but happy memories. Yeah. All right, I think these eggs are getting done. This is the spatula I was going to use. No handle on this spatula. But I think I will change that. This is a better spatula, so I will use the better spatula. These eggs are ready to fold. Yeah, perfect. Fold that over like a half moon. The egg will seal itself in 
encapsulating the cheese. And pretty soon, look at that. Check it out. Sun shines in. Pull this over, tip the pan, flip that over nicely. The perfect cheese omelet. Now, generally, if you're going to make an omelet, you would mix your eggs with some cream. I don't do that because I don't have any cream. If I had some cream, I would do that. And I would like to add onion, green pepper, some sort of meat. Ham is good. Steak is good if it's thin. Cut up small. All right, there's enough heat in these eggs to continue cooking, even though the heat is off. Stick that on the plate there. Now, this is continuing to cook even though the heat is off. So I'm going to let that cook for another minute or two while it cools down. And then I'm going to enjoy me this delightful cheese omelet. Wonderful. So there you have it. Anyway, thanks for stopping by the Filthy Kitchen. Who loves you, baby? This guy. Till next time. Any questions, any comments down below. Remember, you're somebody's favorite person out there. Probably mine. And until next time, think, rest, wait fast. You can always drink water, you can always breathe when you can't do anything else for those going through the tough times. Anyway, till next time, goodbye, love you.